Your pancreas is an organ that does two things. It secretes enzymes that help you digest food, and it creates insulin to regulate blood sugar. But sometimes gallstones, medications, or alcohol can cause pancreatitis. It's inflammation that can be mild or severe, in which case you may need surgery. But now doctors at Mayo Clinic are performing a new procedure that can keep you out of the operating room. 27. 30 watt. Go. It's been a while since Mike Haas enjoyed an evening of cards and snacks with his wife Nancy. I'll eat that one. Severe pancreatitis made snacking impossible. A buildup of dead pancreatic tissue and fluid caused intense back and abdominal pain. It sent Mike to the intensive care unit. When they start talking about you know, the operation and stuff like that, I go, oh, here we go. You know, first time I'm going to be cut open and stuff like that. I wasn't really hip on that, you know. So I just go, I go, I said, well, is there anything, you know, least evasive that we could do? In fact, there is. So here's a CT scan. Dr. Todd Barron uses an endoscope to reach the pancreas, which has traditionally only been accessible with surgery. We're actually um, taking the endoscope and we're making a, purposely making a hole now really dilated with a balloon large enough that we can drive an endoscope through the stomach or the duodenum and actually grab this material and remove it. The debris is dumped into the stomach where it passes through your system normally. 30. Go. Mike had two endoscopic procedures. He'll have one more to remove drains that were placed to make sure all the debris is gone. And after months of pain and no appetite, Mike is getting back to normal. I pretty much eat anything right now. Trail mix and grapes and cheese and crackers. Thanks to the procedure that kept him out of the operating room. Mike says he's thrilled that he didn't have to have a big surgery to treat severe pancreatitis. Dr. Barron says as this technology develops, doctors will be able to treat patients for other conditions that currently require traditional surgery. For Medical Edge, I'm Vivian Williams.